Hey, what's up guys? It's Brandon here with Ballast Home Flipping. And uh, kind of want to do a little comparison between the Glider Co. Original 4 and the Arctic. Um, kind of talk about uh, what they have in common, what makes them different from each other, and what's the better flipper, in my opinion. Um, so let's go ahead and start with the um, original four. So this construction is a channel which means that on the sides here um, it is solid as a rock and it is closed off so that way when this thing is closed you cannot see the blade from the side and that offers for more durability and a little more handle heaviness um, which can uh, it can help and can hurt um, different people's styles depending on how they flip um, For mine, I like a little bit handle heaviness um, A lot of people like neutral I think that a little bit of handle heaviness can definitely add some fun But um, as for this original 4, I think that it is a good flipper and It is very comfortable. It's a little bit heavier than the Arctic. I think by like 0.2 or something ounces. I don't know but um, yeah, uh, I mean, personally, I just, I really like this one, but, um, yeah, anyway, now let's go on to the Arctic, and as you can see, uh, unlike the original four, this one has Zen pins, but they're hidden, uh, and the construction is different, it's actually sandwiched, and they flattened it on the outside, which is, uh, really good for grip, because it's also a little bit thicker, too, um, now, uh, these do definitely flip differently. The Arctic is a little bit lighter and a little bit lighter in the handles as well. So it kind of gives it a more neutral feel. It's, you could say it has the slightest handle bias, but there's definitely a balanced difference between this and the um, original four. So personally, um, out of the ones that, I, which one do I think flips better? Uh, people would ask so I actually think that this Arctic flips better than the original four um, But I think that the original four in my opinion kind of looks uh, it, it looks sounds and I Mean so to me, I think that this looks better and I think that it sounds better. And I wanted to say that it is definitely more durable because of that, uh, you know, channel design. Um, but yeah, I mean, this thing just looks beautiful, as you can see. But the Arctic is also just as beautiful. Um, I just think that it flips, oop, as I go to flip it all crazy, but I think that it just flips better than um, the channel construction one only because it's lighter. So I feel like maybe it just is more comfortable to flip rather than it, you know, it actually being a better flipper because comfortability and flippability kind of go hand in hand um, because you know, if you're flipping something, you want it to be comfortable. And if it's comfortable, you might even say that that's a better experience for flipping. But yeah, so because this is lighter, I think that it's just more comfortable. And that's what makes it the better flipper. But as far as flippability goes for the OG V4, I would say that this is a good flipper, no less. Um, it just is not as weight comfortable because comfortability of like pressing this on your fingers on the corners it's very comfortable actually in comparison to a lot of bella songs but the weight is heavier so 
that could be a drawback for a lot of people, especially if you flip whoop, every hour of the day like me. But um, anyway, yeah, this was just a, a light comparison between the OG V4 and the Glider Co. Arctic. Now, in the final end of this, I'm going to say that I like the OG V4 more, but I think that the Arctic is the better flipper, um, and especially for the price. So, yeah, that's my opinions and thoughts, and until the next time, I'll be seeing you guys later. Yeet.